Sitgo Lake Charles is serious about personal safety. We hear it all the time, but do we really understand the message? Injuries have the ability to change us and to change people around us. Awareness is the key to prevention. We can't personally guard against what we don't recognize. We believe taking a second look and thinking the job through can make it safer. Everyone deserves to work in a safe environment and leave the refinery injury free. We invite you to become involved in Sitgo Lake Charles' I Own Safety Program. We helped form it, manage it, and we believe in its message. I, I Own safety. safety. Meet Mike. Mike is one of those all around good guys. He works hard to provide well for his family. Here's his wife, Mary, and their two kids, David and Carol. Mike is a lot like you and me. He looks out for other people, spends time with his family. He goes to as many Little League games as he can. He squeezes in a few hunting and fishing trips, and he does his best on the job. On one of those ordinary days at work, Mike was working a job in his usual area, gathering tools, setting up equipment, and looking at everything that needed to be done. Instead of taking a second look to recognize all the possible hazards around him, he proceeded with the job. A brief moment of distraction completely changed his life. Mike had a very serious accident. He was brought to the hospital. After the medical team did all they could do, the doctor told Mary that Mike would never be the same. Their dreams for the future, enough money to send their kids to college, their retirement plans, maybe traveling a little. Nothing would be the way they had planned. Mike began the slow adjustment to losing his independence. He needed assistance for everyday needs, eating, going to the restroom, and bathing. A wheelchair was his way to get around. As the months slowly went by, he began to notice that Mary became more quiet and withdrawn and his kids weren't around as much. His friends didn't know what to say. Phone calls for hunting and fishing trips abruptly stopped. In fact, phone calls were rare. No one knew what to say. If only he could rewind time and have another chance. What if this happens to you? What happens to your family? Accidents can happen to any of us. Being safety-minded not only protects an individual, it also protects that person's family and their future. At Sitco Lake Charles, we work for zero injuries. We want all employees to maintain safety on the job. For the sake of themselves, their co-workers, and their families, here are the core principles of safety at Sitco Lake Charles. Each individual controls their own safety destiny. Every injury is preventable. There are no exceptions. Everyone has the right to leave as they came, workplace injury-free. There is no separation in a safety work culture. We are all on one team working toward a sustainable common goal, safe, reliable, and environmentally sound refining operations. The right to be heard and contribute to the common goal of safe, reliable, and environmentally sound refining operations is true for everyone. Each individual is equally accountable for safety, for themselves and others around them. We believe no job is so important or so critical that safety would need to be compromised in any way. Procedures are written as a sustainable safety tool. They shall be current and followed. There are no shortcuts. We will stop and analyze change. Individuals have an obligation to stop work if safety is uncertain or questionable. Supervisors and management are required to respond in a timely and professional manner. We believe that individual commitment to safety includes safety awareness for yourself, your co-worker, and your family. A commitment to safety is a requirement to work in this facility. Understand that you are accountable. Be sure you first preach by the way you live. If you do not, people will notice that you say one thing, but live otherwise. Your words will bring only cynical laughter and a derisive shake of the head. <laughs>